Hi, my name is Grace, and today I'm going to read the Bible story. Today's the Bible title is A Forever Promise The New Heaven and the Earth. Let's read. Let's read. John was the disciple of Jesus. One day, Jesus came to him in a vision, shining like a sun. Don't be afraid, he said. Said Jesus, I die now. I live forever. So, John was the disciple of Jesus. And one day, like, Jesus came to John and said, Don't be afraid, I am Jesus. I have died and I live forever. Do you know why John is here? Because like he was telling about Jesus and the people has so the people has um, put John in the island. When John saw the new heaven and the earth, God's promise, new creation, the first heaven and the first earth were gone, and the sea with them. So John saw the new heaven and the earth. It was God's promised new creation. And John saw the creation, new creation of the world. Question How did Jesus appear to John? Number one, in his image. Number two, in a mountain. Number three, apple tree, palm tree, coconut tree. I don't know. Number one was a great answer. John saw God's holy city, the new Jerusalem. It was coming down from heaven and heaven. It was beautiful, like a bride on her wedding day, ready to meet her husband. So, also John saw God's holy city the new Jerusalem with the shining with the gold and emeralds, diamonds and like those things and it was wonderful beautiful it was just like a bride on a wedding day to meet your husband Found the Bible drum. Peaceful. When John heard this, a loud voice coming from the throne of God saying, From now on, God will make his home among his people, and they will live together. So there was a one loud voice coming from the throne of God saying, So do you, God said, God will make his homes among his people and who believe in Jesus that they can live in the new creation heaven. In this new heaven and earth, there won't be any tears because no one will be in pain and no one will die. Those things 
are given or gone forever. So, so that was a new heaven and the earth. There won't be any tears, and no one will die. There will be no pain, and there, there, these things will gone forever. And like he, no one will be sad in this uh, heaven and yours, but. <laughs> All of you believe in Jesus that Jesus has forgiven our sins. Like, who can believe that? Who is believing that? Or oh, can go to the heaven? Then a voice said, um, Then the voice from the throne said, I am the beginning and the end. If you're thirsty, come to me, and I will give you the water of life. So Jesus said, Then the voice said, If you're thirsty, come to me. I am beginning and the end. I will give you the water of life. Another Bible than Jen. Faithfulness, we have got to faithfulness and question. Will there be pain and death in the new heaven and the earth? No. There will be no pains and death and sadness. All those things will gone forever in this land. My new word is for my children, those who are faithful to me, and making all this new. It's true, you can count on it. So Jesus said, these words is for my children. Who is faithful to me and believe that Jesus has died for us to forgive our sins. And I am making all these new things. God has made the new things. You will count on it. You're looking all happy, right? The new word will be for those who believe in Jesus and are faithful to him. True. Yesterday I read the Bible story, did I enjoy them? Like it is almost last story in the Kiss Bible. And we will have reviving the day and the Kiss Bible will finish, but I think I will the game break the kiss bible yesterday I read the bible story did I enjoy the next time I will read another good story the next time bye